it like to live in Malaysia? How much are people paid as expats in Malaysia and what kind of jobs do they do? Now this channel is, as you know, for those who regularly watch it, a channel for expats and high net wealth individuals all around the world. So what we've decided to do is have numerous street interviews in different places in the world. For the first street interview we have decided on Malaysia because we have some staff there and check out some other interviews that are going to come in places like East Africa and beyond. Before watching this video, check out adam5.com, especially if you're an expat or a high net wealth individual, or for that matter, thinking about going abroad. What is your name? Robert. Robert, so where are you from? Hungary. Hungary, all right. So what are you doing here in Malaysia? Working. Working, uh, working as? Uh, working as a finance director at the company uh, Dutch Lady. How is the cost of living here in Malaysia for you? Cost of living? Yeah. Higher than expected. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get your name? Uh, my name is Miki. Okay, Miki. Oh, where are you from? I'm from Japan. Japan, mm -hmm. okay. And uh, why did you come to Malaysia and what do you do here? Uh, because of my husband, Joe, he, he came to Malaysia for only three years. So I just followed him and then usually I just stay for like just a housewife. Okay. Uh, so, so far, your experience here, right? What do you think of the cost of living in Malaysia? Cost of living, like compared to Japan, it's very cheaper. But we, mm, if we go out, it's very cheaper. Restaurant is cheaper, and also the gas, the fuel, fuel like uh, driving. Uh, the fuel is very low. Oh, the, the cost of the fuel. Cost of the fuel uh, compared to Japan. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, what is your name, sir? Khalid. Khalid. Yeah. And uh, where are you from? Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia. Okay. In your opinion, what is the how is the cost of living like in Malaysia? Uh, it's uh, it's uh, I think it's good, comparing to other places with the level of uh, living. Of course, it's good because uh, the quality of life here also is high. I don't see much also pollution. A green area always uh, there's a green. I think green is important to keep the environment also. So the good things that here you are keeping the greens, mm -hmm. even in the city where the like Kuala Lumpur, I think it's, the land is expensive, I believe, yeah. but still maintaining the green areas and so on. That's yeah. very positive things. In terms of like an estimate, how much do you think a person needs to have, uh, to have a good lifestyle? Uh, yeah, I frequently come here, but short time, so it doesn't uh, the cost of living or so. It is reasonable, I believe. It's, it's not, especially now everywhere there is inflation, high inflation. And mm -hmm. here it's uh, reasonable, it's good. Uh, I don't feel that I'm spending like Europe, for example. Mm. What is your name? Tim. Tim. And where are you from? I'm from the UK. What are you doing here? So my company has a subsidiary that looks after Asia, New Zealand and Australia. Okay. Uh, and from September, I will take over the role of senior sales manager. Uh, right. So I've moved here now to start selling in before I uh, go to work. So what do you think about the cost of living here in Malaysia? Um, the cost of living so far, obviously, if you're eating out, it's a lot cheaper than the UK. Unless you have alcohol. Alcohol, obviously, with a tax on it, yeah. is quite expensive here. Yeah. But for just eating out food-wise, I think it's, it's a lot cheaper. Mm -hmm. I haven't really done much shopping yet, so I can't really say <laughs> how, how I find the shopping yet. So. Okay, cool. What is your name? My name is Guna. His name is Aman. Okay, and uh, where are you guys from? We are from Turkmenistan. Why did you come to Malaysia and what do you do here? Uh, for now, we are just traveling. Oh, okay, yeah. all right. How long are you traveling in Malaysia? Uh, it's been like a couple of months. Oh, now. okay, cool. Yeah. So how is the cost of living here so far? The cost of living is, I think, it's doable uh, compared to a lot of other developed countries. I think it's more uh, cheaper and affordable to live here. What's your name? Kenny. Kenny, okay. where are you from? Uh, South Africa. All right, so what are you doing here in Malaysia? Uh, working, studying, uh, exploring. Okay, what are you working at? A graphic designer. Okay, cool. So what do you think about the... Uh, cost of living in Malaysia? Uh, it's not too bad. It's affordable compared to like Singapore, I suppose. Okay. Yeah, All right. it's affordable. Okay. My name is Lisa. And where are you from? I'm from the Netherlands. Okay, so um, what are you doing here in Malaysia? What are you working uh, I'm here as an intern, so I'm still studying in the Netherlands and I work in Visual Design. 
Okay, so in your opinion, what is the, how much is the cost of living like in Malaysia for you? Um, I think the cost of living is compared to the Netherlands quite okay. Mm -hmm. But in comparison to what you make, it's, I think, the same. Okay. Say. What is your name? So my name is Salfa Jokiate from Guinea Conakry, West Africa. Okay. So how is the cost of living for you here? Uh, it's not that high, but comparatively to Europe, like let's say if you take the, this country, Canada, yeah, of course, but the rate of the currency is kind of different. But if you take comparatively to the country, Africa, mm. it's kind of high, but this can be affordable. How much do you need to earn in a month to have a comfortable life here in Malaysia, in KL? Um, yeah, I'm alone myself now, so I would say something like, 5,000 ringgit, I guess. Okay, or, cool. Or myself. Right. So that's exclu sorry, that's excluding the, the, the housing, so yeah. Oh, it would be much more than that. Oh, it would be more. So more than 5,000? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So I will, I will, this is just the cost of living, the food and uh, right. car and transport and all right. that, top of it, the housing. Right. And if you have a family that's schooling and all that, top of that. Right. And yeah. how much do you feel like you need to have a comfortable lifestyle here? Um, it depends on the rent. <laughs> I think my rent is quite expensive to, yeah, compared to the normal. I would say 3,000 ringgit. How much do you need to live a good lifestyle in Malaysia? Good lifestyle in <laughs> Malaysia? Yeah. That is depend as I'm single. So uh, each month, if I'm having like the basic five thousand ringgit, of course. Okay. In your opinion, how much do you think you need in a month to live a comfortable lifestyle? Comfortable life. Mm. Mm, like uh, it's a very difficult question. Like we are Japanese, so we have to not we have to like. I always choose the Japanese materials, like Japanese basis and the Japanese, I guess, ingredients, like seasoning, so mm. so. That's why it's gonna be a little bit cost uh, compared to the local things. So that's why. Like if you had to give an estimation, right? Like uh, yeah, yeah. 4,000 ringgit or 5,000 ringgit. Yeah. What do you think? Uh, at least 5,000 ringgit we need. <laughs> How much do you need to earn to have a good lifestyle here, you think? Uh, like 20,000 ringgit a month, maybe. <laughs> okay, cool. How much do you need so far every month to have a good lifestyle? You know, to do a go out, For fun. our li lifestyle, yeah. uh, like to live comfortable, I think about 1,000 US dollars. Okay. In terms of having a good lifestyle, right? How much do you think you need to have to be able to have a good lifestyle here? Like? Um, I don't know, again, it's too early for me to say yet, but, uh, yeah. but certainly I think that the money I earn at here mm. will go further than the money I earn if I earn the same back home. I, see. Uh, I think that it will be cheaper to live here. For sure. Yeah. Cool. Have you faced any financial challenges so far in Malaysia? Uh, no, because we get uh, money from the, government, from the Dutch government. Um, any financial challenges so far for you? No, I can say uh, I am. I feel blessed. <laughs> okay, cool. I have good conditions. Uh huh. Do you face any financial challenges so far living here? Several months? No, no. So not been, it's really. been good. Yeah, it's been really good. Yeah. It's as I said, it's really affordable to and very convenient to live here. Oh, that's cool. And do you experience any financial challenges so far? Uh, none again. Like everyone does. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah. Uh, what about your health insurance? Like um. How do you find the healthcare system? Right so here? I've been sent by my company from Europe here, and uh, it's all taken care of. So I, again, I feel blessed that I uh, yeah. I have a very good health insurance, very good package, and also a good right. health, health insurance. Yeah. yeah, health insurance in Malaysia. We have the Japanese insurance company in Malaysia. That's why we don't worry about anything because oh, we come to Malaysia for a temporary life, like mm. like. Uh, my husband company prepare all things for the insurance, so that's why we we never think about the, the, the so things. How about your um, insurance, health insurance? Do you have that? Um, well, I work for a Swedish company, and, yeah. and they they cover all of that. So 
that's covered by a Swedish company back home, so I'm covered for all medical, dental, etc. So. Oh, that's great. How about health insurance? Do you have health insurance? Yes. In yeah. the Netherlands. Yeah. So you haven't had to yeah. use the healthcare system in Malaysia so far? Or? No. No, we only use the Netherlands one. Okay. How about the healthcare system? Have you had to try and use it? I have used it a few times. It's pretty good. Cool, all right. Do you it's have good. health insurance? No. You don't? Okay. Not international, no. Ah, okay. Do you invest your money? Uh, yeah, I, 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 <laughs> uh, I have an account here, so, yeah. but uh, the treatment is good chance here. I'm looking for uh, also real estate, but not yet. In Malaysia? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm, okay. Yeah. You invest your money, by the way, and have you been investing since traveling in Malaysia? Uh, in Malaysia, we haven't been trying to invest in anything yet, mm. but mm. we are looking for options. Okay. Do you invest for Malaysia? Privately? Yeah, privately. Like in stocks or anything? Sorry? Like in stocks or cryptocurrency or all no, that? No, 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 no. Yeah. Right. I just moved actually three months ago, so it, it hasn't been for a very long experience. <laughs> oh, you just moved here yeah, three months ago? Three months ago. Oh, okay, cool. You invest money? I do. In Malaysia? Or from Malaysia? No. <laughs> no, <laughs> in the Netflix. <laughs> okay, cool. Right, and lastly, um, you don't mind sharing? You mind sharing the range of what you earn? Range? Yeah. What I earn? Yeah. In Ringgit? In Ringgit in Malaysia. Uh, range is like 15 to 25. All right, cool. All right, thank you. If you don't mind me asking, could you share like maybe how much is your husband earning or like a range? A salary? Yeah. Eh, I'm not sure, <laughs> but how can I say? I don't know how much he gets, but he gave me for the allowance, right? Yeah, allowance. I, I cannot calculate it. <laughs> About uh, Oh. But three thousand ringgit mm, for mm. using uh, like a food and all that. Like floors, uh, what you want. <laughs> okay. And finally, if you don't mind me asking, how much you earn from your internship? Uh, Six hundred ringgit. Mm, all right. Cool. All right. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> and finally, uh, my last question is: Do you mind sharing your range of your of how much you're earning? Probably about forty thousand ringgit a month. All right. Cool. Net. All right. Cool. Alright, thank you Tim. No thank problem. you so much.